over 134 million Nigerians multidimensionally poor? Is it sensitive that those who are supposed to represent the people go to Abuja and lavish themselves with luxury vehicle? Is that sensitive, Senator? Are we supposed to do our oversight function tracking or going without uh, vehicles? Senator, you know, a lot of Nigerians may not be happy with you guys right now. You, are you aware? Uh, you are seeing a lot of Nigerians there. Nigerians are not seeing other people in the executive. Is that the reason? Is that an excuse in, enough? In vehicle? Is that an excuse Why enough? are you guys speaking on, picking on Nigerian? Because you are the representative of the people. Yeah. You have voted in office to feel the pain of the people. Yeah. But it doesn't look like you guys are feeling it, are you? We're making a lot of sacrifice. You don't know. Including buying luxury vehicles. The moment a man becomes a politician in Nigeria, he automatically becomes an orphan. It is so sad that this is the experience and the reality of we Nigerians. We get to elect people into office and these people don't even care about us. The video you're about to watch, that I'm about to play now, will give you a crystal clear you know, picture of what the average politician in that Senate, in, in the average politician we elected to, to, you know, to lead us, it will give you a crystal clear you know, image of how they feel about us. Like, they don't care. They really, really don't care. They don't care. So I'm going to play the video. Please, I'm warning. If you know you don't have the heart to watch this kind of um, video, please, just scroll away. Because this is going to hurt you. It is going to hurt you. Somebody elected to lead and rule, you know, and, 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 and lead the affairs of a particular constituency is in a national on a national on national television i don't think he's on a national television say, like speaking as if he doesn't care not is he speaking as if he really doesn't care you understand he doesn't care because if this man cares you know you will see it in the way he speaks no empathy nothing nothing what okay i'm going to play the video so let's watch the video and then will come back on the end of the video. If in case I don't come back at the end of the video, that means I I I could I could not I could not bear it. You understand? I could not bear it. So like this video, subscribe to the channel so that more people can see how our politicians really feel about us. You understand? Let's play the video. Is it sensitive to be spending 140 million? If I give you 140 million naira cash to take it to your central district, won't your people benefit from it? Let, let me tell you sure. I don't want to go personal. I don't want to go personal. Those, that same vehicle that you're talking of, before coming to the National Assembly, I have a vehicle that I have bigger than that. But this is Nigerian money. Yeah, so I'm, Nigeria does not have money at the moment. So 26 point something uh, uh, inflation rate with over 34 percent of Nigerians so unemployed. Are we supposed with to with over 134 so million Nigerians? multidimensionally poor is it sensitive that those who are supposed to represent the people go to abuja and lavish themselves with luxury vehicle is that sensitive Senator? Sure, are we supposed to do our oversight function tracking or going without uh, vehicles maybe you could have cons i mean considered a, a, a more cheaper vehicles maybe, to get the job done. maybe maybe, maybe the, a car maybe, uh, Maybe a sedan. If I travel to maybe okay. a twenty-five million naira worth of sedan, I, it you, might do the job. If I travel to my constituency with a car now, the time I go three, four times. You know Nigerian roads. Is that not an indictment on you, those of you who are in power? That what? Those of you who are leaders in Nigeria today. Is that not an indictment? Uh, that we have bad roads in the states, in your local government, in the senatorial district. Is that not an indictment that on not, those of you who are in power? It's, it's a discussion for another day. You see the level of... Uh, Was like Nigerians suffer for the inefficiency of those who are in power, let me tell Senator? You, and you, if you look at Nigerian roads all over the Federation, that we have a serious problem. Because nothing much has been done in the last few years. Most of our roads, they are terribly bad. In fact, the government cannot even have on enough work on those roads. We have to go back into a PPP, um, a private uh, partnership arrangement where people can invest through those roads and get their money in return. It is, it is done 
We, we will find out whether or not what you are doing is illegal or what you are doing as a senator or as, as lawmakers in the eye of the law is right or wrong or whether or not it's morally uh, justified. But Section 84 of the Nigerian Constitution empowers Ramfak to mandate or determine the salaries, allowances of public officials, including members of the National Assembly. And this is what Ramfak, based on the last published uh, 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 figure of the sa basic salary of a senator. It says that a senator earns 2 point something million naira. Therefore, with that, a senator should be entitled to about 8.1 million naira worth of vehicle, which is about 400% of your basic salary. That is what the law on the ramp fact says, senator. And for your colleagues in the lower chamber, their basic salary as last published was about 1.9 million. And you can draw a car loan uh, to the to the extent of uh, 7.9 million, but you can't exceed that. That is what the Ramfak law says. But if you're buying a vehicle of 140 million naira, based on this, it I'm says not, something is wrong. I'm not even. Don't forget that I'm not. I, I didn't tell you that we were. We were I don't even know the figure as I'm talking to you. Because it's not my responsibility. If you are buying a Land Cruiser, we've done our own research and I've given you a median of I've what it costs in the market right now. No, so we heard that the cost that National Assembly is getting is 160 million. But I've taken that figure and put it under the table. I've given you a 140 million. Prado is about 85 to 90 million naira. So let's assume that you're buying another 140 million, no matter what the case may be. Senator, can you look Nigerians in the eye tonight and say what you are doing is sensible and appeal to the sensibilities to the, of Nigerians? Who are poor some of them who cannot even afford a food on their table tonight some of them will go hungry without being able to provide for their families some of them who are multi-dimensionally poor dollar to a naira is about 1250 and we have our lawmakers buying this kind of vehicle is that right is that justifiable senator um sure is it only nigerian senators and also members that are using what does it make it right if you're not the only one huh? i mean and i'm not i'm not, not making any allegations against you and i'm still so saying that um, can I, if anybody is can doing I ask, something can wrong I i'm not the only one doing can it I ask, other people can are I ask you a question Sion. go ahead please your mba is it by md or the head of your this thing which, which type of work is it using I use an SUV. That's why I told you. SUV. It's an SUV. I use a mini SUV based on the status of, of my role here. And that's why I why do that you buy buying Nigerian made vehicle? I have. My vehicle is a Nigerian, is produced here in Nigeria. Which was? Which, which, I use a GAC that was coupled in Lagos. Well, how, how much did you buy? It's a company, it's an official vehicle. So, your, your company chose to, to buy you Official that. vehicle, as so, a private organization. So, but you are a public officer, yeah, Senator. Yeah. And that's why we are asking you and, tonight. He will and the equity is, must come with clean as senator. Nigerians are suffering. There's poverty in the land. Can you for a moment even jettison that idea to show Nigerians that you guys are committed to the plight of the poor people? That you cannot run government as usual. Can you are a member of the APC, a senior member of the APC? Can Nigerians trust the APC and the leaders of today that they really care about the people of this country? You know, Assembly. Assembly, we talk of the same thing. Maybe as as a, a local manufacturing plant develop, we, we we choose to we may choose to partner. The GAC, in collaboration with the Lagos State Government, just launched two thousand vehicles. There is innocent in Anambra State. There's another young man who is producing a vehicle that will be useful. If you say utility vehicle, is another Nigerian. Just his name just skipped my mind right now. Not N O R D is a Nigerian young man producing vehicle, and this set of people will look at you who are supposed to be leaders of Nigeria. How disappointed do you think they would be in you? We have not. I've just said that uh, in future we may this. We can't. We would do. And surely as Nigerian manufacturing sector develop. Senator, we'll you know a lot of Nigerians may not be happy with you guys right now. You, are you aware? Uh, you are seeing a lot of Nigerians there. Nigerians are not seeing other people in the executive. Is that the reason? The is that an excuse enough? Same vehicle? Is that an excuse Why enough? are you guys speaking on, picking on Nigerian? Because you are the representative of the people. Yeah. You have voted in office to feel the pain of the people. Yeah. Or it doesn't look like you guys are feeling it, are you? We're making a lot of sacrifice. You don't know. 
including buying luxury vehicles. <sighs> ah, well, um, the thing is, I blame we Nigerians, you understand? I blame the citizens of Nigerians. I blame we, we, the Nigerian people, you know, that elect these people into office. Because when the time comes again for them to come and campaign, they know how to get you guys. They come with tribalism. They come with religion. They come with all of these unnecessary things to bug you guys. And you guys will accept it, let it manipulate you, and you vote them back into office to go and continue their, you know, their lavish. I don't even know the English to use currently. To go and continue their, 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 their nonsense. To go and continue, you know, lav lavishing the future of, of our, our future. This is so sad. Imagine how this man is playing down the, the tenacity of the questions Sheon is asking. He's playing it down, asking, you know, answering unnecessary answers. Like, do, 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 do you see that place Sheon was listing out um, the, the problems we are facing? Where people, you said some people cannot even have food to eat on their table, the dollar is increasing. This one, that one, it was like, can you imagine? These are people that we elect to, to lead us. This is just one of one out of, and you can imagine how the rest are. Maybe when they, when they are sitting, you will be like, leave them, they will be all right. And we, we Nigerians, we know how to adapt. Is it that we know how to adapt or they've, or they've conditioned us and taught us how to adapt? Because I don't really understand. Why are we still sleep? Why are we still sleeping and sitting and, and looking and watching these people? What is really going on? Is it that there's nothing we can do? This is so alarming. This video is so annoying. Like this video is biting the, whole, the hell out of me. It's making me want to like, you know, as if, as if I had that full all the other way. Like this video is so insensitive. Like this video is, is everything bad. Can you imagine? Ah, Nigeria, what have we become? Nigerian youth, what are we doing? Wow. 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 So his name is Senator Karimi. Senator Karimi. He represents the uh, the rot in the not the National Assembly. So guys, this is the video. I don't know what you think about this video, but um, whatever you think about the video, please drop it in the comment section. Um, also, like this video so that more people can watch to see how our national, our 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 the, our leaders, what they what they really feel about us. You understand? So that we, we on, when election comes, we know the right people. The right people to put in this office might not they may they may not be popular, but they have good intentions, and and they are willing to work. So please. In our next next election, please let's do better. I don't does election even work in this country? See, we all know what we need in this country. We all know what we need to do for a change to happen in Nigeria. We all know. But let's keep doing as if we don't know and let this suffer continues. People are people are dying. The more we say, oh, if we do this one, people will die. People, but people are dying every day. Bandits are killing. No food to eat. People are dying of hunger. Sickness is killing. Transportation, accidents everywhere is killing. A lot of things are still going on. Fake drugs everywhere, killing people in the hospitals. Our health centers, our health sectors are not working. And we are still here saying no uh, blood. No Allah. No Allah. So um, like this video, subscribe to the channel. This is Afri Tip. Here you get informed, educated, and entertained. So um, join the Afri Tip family by subscribing once again. See you in the next video. Peace.